Okay, be honest. Raise your hand if you thought Notre Dame was going to finish the season undefeated, rank number one, and become the first team to secure a parking spot in front of the BCS championship. And I'm not talking about joining the blue and gold bandwagon a couple of weeks ago. I'm talking about August, before the Irish had even played a game. Yeah, that's what I thought. Nobody. Well, almost nobody. Manti Teo believed, and so did the rest of the Notre Dame roster. Brian Kelly thought it was possible if about 10,000 different things went right for the Irish. This is a team that wasn't even ranked in the Associated Press preseason poll. This is a team with a redshirt freshman quarterback. This is a team, and there's no other way of saying it, that has made the impossible possible. They beat Navy, Purdue, Michigan State, Michigan, Miami, Stanford, BYU, Oklahoma, Pittsburgh, Boston College, Wake Forest, and USC. That's nine teams with enough wins to play in bowls. They defied the odds. They ignored the predictions. And now, they're playing in a national championship. I don't think we owe Notre Dame an apology. Nah, I think we owe them a standing ovation.